What is going on? Tony from HowToBuyAndSellYourCars.com And I just wanted to say hi, long time no speak. Well, it's just been a few weeks. Um, and I just want to tell you, hey, I'm in Japan. I am in Japan, man. Um, and that's the cool thing about buying and selling cars for profits. You could basically use that as a means to get to save money to invest it in another side business, an online business, or whatever you your ultimate end goal is, you could use the funds from buying and selling cars for profit and put it into another passion or something that you really want to do. You know, because it's it's cool to be able to take a grand or two and flip it uh, and make a thousand or two thousand dollars profit on that uh, within seven to ten days or two weeks, you know, whatever the case is. And just to do it over and over again anytime you wish uh, to pay for bills, to go on vacation, to invest in other businesses, whatever you want to do is the cool thing uh, about it. You know, it's very, very flexible and you don't need a lot of experience to do it. You just need to know a few key factors on how to buy, how to negotiate and how to sell properly to really, you know, put some turbocharge in back of your whole you know, selling campaigns and your buying and your negotiation strategies. And um, that's, you know, really all you have to do. So I'm here in Japan. It's a real muggy, rainy day right now. Um, I'm in a little studio, which I'm calling my home office for now, where I'm doing some some work. Got a little bed there if I want to crash. I got my camera here set up. Um, little desk over here. I'm working on some stuff. And here's the outside. I'll show you outside in a bit. Uh, but this is a little a heater thing like you you sit under this blanket and under this table here you basically have a heater element that heats stuff up you know and, and it heats the whole underneath of the table up so you can keep your feet warm and all that you don't have to have the whole heater on in the room like I do right now <laughs> uh, to keep warm but let me show you uh, quickly couple of things that you probably never even seen before if you've never uh, went to Japan or lived in, a, in an outside country. Now, you hear everyone saying that in Japan, everything is small, right? So just check out this toilet, for instance. Okay, so basically, here's the door, right? Here's the bathroom door. We're going to open it, and all you see is the toilet. It's just maybe three feet wide, maybe not even. I would say it's three feet wide by maybe five feet deep. All right, so it's 15 square feet basically. And then you got something pretty cool. There's no room for a sink in here, but when you flush the toilet, right? That, that's your sink. You got the incoming water coming in. You can wash your hands here. Some, some places have a little soap tray here where you could just put some soap in there. But they usually recommend not having soap because it, it creates uh, a soap ring inside of the, the tank. But that's basically it. It fills in, you wash your hands quickly, fills up, fills up the toilet, and that's it. Pretty crazy. And then here, you're supposed to have a little washer set up, but we got no washer here. Little sink area. And you can see how low this is. If, if I come next to it here, it's, you know, basically on my thigh, and I'm, I'm not a tall dude, so it would probably be even lower on some people. And then you have the little shower area where it's just, there's a little door here, right? And then you go on, you take a shower right here, and then after you're all clean, you take a shower, you go into the tub here, which you can set it like a little, they call it an onsen, you know, like a little hot tub. Basically, and you go in, you soak and all that, and then you come out and dry yourself off. Anyway, I just wanted to show you that. I thought it was pretty neat. You've probably never seen any of this before. Um, and then we got the outside area here. And like I said, it's raining across the street. We got a school across the street. And um, this is where I'm at. All right, so um, anyway, I also got some pretty cool news. Um, I know in my F1 course, my buy, How to Buy and Sell Cars course, I recommend AAA a lot um, for car towings and using that service to get free tows, five to 10 free tows per year on your car flips. 
Um, but I actually stumbled across, well, I didn't stumble across it. I was a member for about six months now uh, to something called MCA, the Motor Club of America. And they have a lot of cool benefits that I think even you would would like. Um, there's a lot of pros about it than AAA. And um, I'm going to be sharing with you uh, some information on MCA in a little while. And there's also a money-making opportunity to it for you as well. So it's it's like a referral program. So if you refer friends and family or or you know do some online marketing stuff, which I've been doing lately and making a lot of money from MCA, um, you could do that as well. And it's pretty, pretty crazy. So if you're interested about that, comment below on the video here and let me know if you're interested. I can show you the program, what I'm using to generate a few extra thousand dollars per month. Um, just promoting that on the side and um, if you join my team I'll show you exactly how to do some you know online marketing things what's working for me right now and you could basically use that to generate some money so if you don't have enough money you know to buy and sell a car you don't have a thousand or two thousand dollars to get started you could basically start promoting MCA um, make the couple grand and then get into buying and selling cars or you could just do MCA but I would prefer, you know, using MCA um, as a side thing. You know, it's it's a good side income. I could probably easily show you how to generate 20, 30% of what I'm doing right now with minimal work. Um, you know, if, if you were able to make five to 600, 700, 1,000 a month from MCA, um, I think that would be a great, you know, great plus to your income. Um, for me, I'm doing an average of $2,000 a month now, and I'm only doing it for uh, the past six weeks now. So it's pretty, pretty cool. Um, anyway, I just wanted to show you my area in Japan, uh, you know, my little bunk bed there, my little desk doing a little bit of work and uh, I'm going to get back to work, get some stuff done. But again, it's Tony from how to buy and sell your cars.com. Um, if you want to learn how to buy and sell cars for profit, take that money, invest it into other online or offline businesses. Um, let me show you what I'm doing. So, uh, join me in my programs and I'll see you inside. Have a great day. Cheers. Bye.